I'm heading to a place known for its population of wild sea lions. The unique spot is a small island located off the coast of Peru, better known as Islas Palomino, a location home to thousands of sea lions. To get there, it's a direct flight to Lima, Peru, a city I really enjoy. A busy city of over 9 million people. It's a country where the past and the future blend together peacefully. It's also home to some of the most beautiful coastlines in all of South America. We are near the uh, coast right now, um, just right off of uh, Lima, and uh, we are getting ready to go swim with the sea lions. The journey for Wildside TV begins here, the port city of Calo, a major shipping hub for all of Lima. We board a small craft that will actually take us to a much larger boat to swim with the sea lions. The weather is perfect on this day. Sunshine and pleasant temperatures, the topography is amazing. Islands without a single tree, a desert landscape that runs right into the Pacific Ocean. I know the water is cold, not because I felt it, but because of the penguins that make their home on some of these islands. The current brings in a fresh supply of food for all the marine life. <gasps> Suddenly, we begin to see small heads popping up out of the water off in the distance. It's hundreds, maybe thousands of sea lions. And that must be Islas Palomino. And you guessed it, those sounds are coming from the sea lions. The island is covered with them. The creatures come in all shapes and sizes, and I'm told that the males fight for the best positions on the rocks. Gonna look for some sea lions. Hey, guys! Okay. And we move into the chilly waters. The sea lions are jumping everywhere as we swim towards the island. The animals are under us, swimming gracefully below our feet, trying to get a glimpse of us, but never even touching or bumping into the swimmers. It's amazing. We're told to put our feet up and out of the water. The guide tells us the sea lions will kiss our feet with their whiskers. And sure enough, they do. It's a strange but wonderful feeling being this close to such a powerful animal. Everyone in the water is amazed at how gentle the sea lions are towards humans. They're more like gentle to us than we are to them. It was uh, absolutely like something different out of this world. And what's out of this world is how many sea lions are actually near us. And not one of them gets out of line. It's as if someone has trained them all to be kind. I'm told that there may be 8,000 sea lions that make their home on the island. The experience is truly exhilarating for everyone. Fantastic! I like the kissing of the feet. I like the whiskers on the feet. Isn't that amazing? Love it! Our swim with the sea lions lasts about 40 minutes. It's so relaxing out there that Wildside TV even has time to pose for the camera. Hey, hey. Okay, my name Peru. <laughs> okay. Our time in the water is up. We all head back to the boat. I head to the front of the boat to talk to my fellow sea lion swimmers. We all have something to say about the encounter, including myself. It was absolutely amazing. It was so much fun. And uh, the sea lions were just jumping over your heads and kissing your feet. It just, it was, it was, I'm so glad we did it. It was wonderful. I learned so many things about these animals by swimming with them. And here are some things you may not know about these sea lions. The technical name for the South American sea lion is actually the Patagonia sea lion. They are found along the coast of Peru, Chile, Uruguay, and Argentina. The sea lions feed on a steady diet of anchovies, squid, and octopus. When these items are scarce, they will consume small penguins they find in the wild. Male sea lions, when fully grown, are twice the weight of the females. The males are approximately 9 feet long and weigh close to 800 pounds. These animals do have predators to watch out for. This includes sharks, killer whales, and even, get this, mountain lions that will hunt the sea lions on land. Sea lions can hold their breaths for up to 20 minutes and they can dive up to a thousand feet deep. They can swim at speeds of over 20 miles per hour. You know, they look at you with their big eyes and they're like, and they're looking at you and you're thinking, and they're, you're on my land, but you know, we're not gonna hurt you. Well, this is an animal encounter I will never forget, and it's hard to believe that anyone can go swimming with such amazing animals.